Hey everybody, it's Ped's Card Collection coming back at you with another video. And tonight we have a random baseball card pack opening. So I got a pretty sick lineup together. Uh, got the old birthday edition special, turned 27 today. So it's the New York Yankee World Series ring year, if you will. Um, but got a pretty loaded lineup today, so really excited to get into this. Some familiar packs from the last ones and some new ones. So we're going to get right into this, guys. Got 12 packs total, so I don't want to waste too much time. But we got a 2011 Top Series 1 pack. Got a Hobby Pack of 21 Heritage High Number. Got a 2017 Donruss Hobby Pack. Had some pretty good luck with those for numbered cards. Might be one of those hot boxes. We got a Retail Pack of 2019 Chrome. This is freshly cracked from a value pack. Got a pink 2019 Topps Chrome Pack. Got a 2004 Bowman Chrome looking for Yadier Molina. Got another Upper Deck Update Prospect Edition from 2005. We got a 2022 Series 2 Hobby Pack. We got a 2015 Bowman Draft. We got a 2018 Big League Hobby or Retail. We got a 2017 Topps Finest. And we got a 2014 Topps Series 2 Jumbo Hobby Pack. So gonna set the lineup really quickly, but pretty pumped to get into this 2019 Topps Chrome, my favorite release of all time. That was the product that got me back into the hobby and reintroduced me to my love and passion for cards. So pretty excited for that pack. And was thinking about potentially going live tonight to do like a fun just PC rip, open up one of my hobby hobby boxes that I have um stashed away so i might go live for a little fun rip but gotta see what the rest of the night holds going out to dinner pretty soon so trying to get this video pumped out for you guys now i haven't had too too many videos recently uh there haven't been too many releases from tops or panini so um it's been kind of slow in that regard but should start picking up in August, and I think Tops Tier 1 is coming out later this month. I don't usually open that, but since I haven't really opened any of the new releases like Pristine or um, any of the re recent releases, I'll, I'll probably get a hobby box out of the National. I'm going to be going to the National Tuesday. I'll be there the whole time. We've got a nice Walker Bueller Purple Chrome, so in a way it's been good that I've been saving up funds to hopefully get some really cool wax boxes, hobby boxes, singles from the National. What better place to get cards and come back with some sick boxes than the national so definitely going to try to load up on some inventory there maybe some early 2000s hobby boxes maybe some upper deck maybe some tops chrome we'll see maybe some bowman some bowman chrome got that old piece of gum from 2011 don't recommend trying that got a brian fuentes jeremy guthrie edwin encarnacion ben revere rookie card Got a Justin Morneau, Josh Tolley, remember him with the Mets, and a Hanley Ramirez. Alrighty guys, Series 2 has been pretty good to us. Got a huge short print in our Jumbo Hobby Box. So hopefully I'll be able to track down that Bobby Witt to go along with the J-Rod. So here we go, we got a Kevin Smith rookie card, Sandy Leone. Got a Sticks, who's been absolutely lights out his past like four starts. He's thrown around 23 innings, given up one earned run, around 24 strikeouts, and he's dialed in 0.34 ERA in that stretch. So I picked up a couple of his autos, rookies, recently, and uh, started really ramping up after I bought him, so that kind of worked out well. But uh, hopefully he can keep it going. Got a Peyton Henry, the Marlins called up a uh, pro big prospect and fourth overall pick from 2020, J.J. Bleday from Vanderbilt University. Made his MLB debut yesterday against the Pirates. And I believe he came in as a pinch hitter and drew a walk, so he's got a 1,000 on base percentage, pretty sick. Shout out Adam, if you're watching this, congrats to your brother. Played with uh, J.J. Bleday's brother in college, Adam, who's a good friend of mine. And I uh, was kind enough to get me some signed cards. So rooting for JJ. Got a Mark Mulder. These upper deck packs are pretty fun. Jeff Neiman. We got a Vladimir Ballantine. 
This one's numbered to 599, followed by a Shane Costa Future Reflections and a DJ Holton. So we pulled a Verlander out of one of these packs once. And I don't know if you guys saw, he was absolutely dominant in his start last night or yesterday afternoon. So he was humming that fastball consistently up around 99 miles per hour. And he was really fired up on one of those big strikeouts towards the later end of his uh, outing. And he was really pumped up. I'd love to see that. It's, it's like the guy's 39 years old, but he's pitching like he's 29. So um, some guys are just built differently, cut from different cloths. So. Pretty incredible. All right, here we go. 2017 Donruss. This is a fun one. Aaron Judge hit another home run today against the Orioles, number 37. He's having a godlike season. So um, he is having one of the greatest seasons of all time for New York Yankee ever. So um, hopefully we can get a nice Judge. We've got a Bryce Harper, Steven Piscotti, and a Ryan Braun. So nothing crazy in that pack off to a little bit of a slow start but we got some big boppers coming up trying to get that Danzy Swanson he's been having a great year with the Braves as they catch up to the Mets it's almost inevitable that was going to happen a nice m -m 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 -y Soroka first Bowman paper I wonder where he is in his uh, rehab sin I think he tore his Achilles heel after he had another serious injury and it was just a really tough blow well, here we go with the chrome. We got a Michael Matuela. This is like a silver parallel of Bailey Falter. Oh, that's numbered to 499, guys. So, too bad it's not like a Ryan Mountcastle, but that is numbered. So, a little silver border numbered card. Courtney Hawkins. I remember he was a huge prospect out of Texas. Not Texas University, but he's from Texas. He was highly, highly touted. But, uh, you know... Had a couple, it's not easy to make it to the big leagues. Struggled in the minors, had some power, but couldn't string together enough years to get his chance. But here we go with 2004 Bowman Chrome. We're looking for Yadier Molina. We did pull an auto out of one of these packs. So we got Andy Pettit. We got a Chad Santos. And a Dustin McGowan. So swing and a miss yet again. Let's see if we could turn our luck around with 2018 Big League. This is from, I think I cracked open a blaster box to throw these packs in. So try to pull us a nice Shohei Otani, Ronald Acuna, or Juan Soto. We got Ender Enciarte, Ricky Henderson, Corey Klubot, Nick Markakis. Got a Corey Seager, Chris Sale, Giancarlo Stanton. We got a gold card. It's going to be a Miami Marlon Brian Anderson rookie card. So that's a solid gold. Take that for sure. We're down to our final four packs, ladies and gents. I think this is my last. Or I might have two more of these packs, but one more after we rip this 2014. Haven't pulled anything too crazy out of them just yet. Hopefully we can find an, us a nice Xander Bogarts, something along those lines. So we got a Chris Owings rookie card, Wade Miley. There we go, Derek Jeter. Got a U Darvish. Guess that's what his third year card. Carved up the Mets pretty good. The Mets are struggling mightily offensively. Dropped the first two games to the Padres. So they got a do some soul searching, maybe add a bat before the trade deadline and get this offense rejuvenated because they are very lackadaisical right now. Got a Chris Bryant, Kevin Correa, Trevor Plouffe, now part of John Boy Media. Really cool to uh, see former big leaguers, you know, saying, you know, around the game and growing the game through, you know, teams like that. Even if it's not through coaching, it's, you know, so much has grown um, around the games, trying podcasts, videos, you know, more, like all that stuff. So really fun to interact and hear, you know, his perspective and uh, got a, what it would have been a really nice rookie card. Unfortunately he passed away and I believe it was a boating accident or something along those or a car crash. Rest in peace, Jordano Ventura used to throw easy hundred miles per hour slingshot arm, arm action and uh, he could zip it in there. He was a fiery guy. 
and just a really sad, sad way to go because brought a lot of fun to the league. Nice Max Scherzer, Chris Tillman, Sergio Romo, Eric Sogard for the Athletics. The Mets did get Daniel Vogelbach. Don't know how big of an addition that is. I mean, physically, it's a huge addition, but, I mean, performance-wise and helping the team, I don't know if it's going to, you know, really change the direction of their season or not. Nice Justin Turner. Of course, the Mets got rid of him. J.D. Martinez, Esmeel Rogers, Buddy Boschers, and a Justin Ruggiano. Let's see what the middle of the pack has in store for us, guys. Got a Henderson Alvarez walk-off no-hitter. Evan Longoria. We do have a gold card coming up. So... Ooh, and we have a red hot foil, so let's do a little double barrel marination station combination. Here we go. We got Brandon Crawford, staple to the New York to the I said New York Giants, San Francisco Giants, Bryce Harper, Fred Lynn. We got a DJ Onelki Garcia. Let's see what we got for the gold and the red hot foil. Alrighty. It's a Padre. It's going to be a Tommy Medica rookie card. For, unfortunately, the guy didn't pan out. And then we got ourselves a Ryan Howard. So, had a really nice career. Just wasn't long enough to be a Hall of Famer or healthy enough. But he was an absolute monster for the Phillies there. When them Helped them win a World Series in, what was that, 2008 or 2009? So, I think it was 2008. Um, when they had Cole Hamels, Roy Halladay. Um, all those Cliff Lee, all those monster pitchers, Jimmy Rollins, Ryan Howard, Pat Burrell. I mean, they were just stacked beyond belief. Um, so we do have a thick card. Every time I feel like we get a thick card in one of these packs, it turns out to not be an auto. So fingers crossed for an auto here, guys. Trying to finish with a bang. Haven't really had much to show for just yet. But it ain't over till it's over. Got a Ryan Braun, Starling Marte. One more card. Noah Trader Guard. <laughs> and then let's see what we got, guys. It's a batter. It's like a Boston Red Sox. Could that be Benintendi? Please, God, be Andrew Benintendi. Please give me some ink. No ink, but that does look like some sort of parallel. So not autograph but super thick card stock and he has been a name that's been thrown around quite frequently i've heard the yankees have taken a pretty strong liking to him and might try to go after him so that's a nice little variation rookie card of andrew benintendi kind of rejuvenated his career past two years and uh, he's batting over 300 this year got over 100 hits and really been a great addition to the uh, the Royals. So here we go. Last two packs, 2019 Chrome. What better way to cap this random pack video than with 2019 Topps Chrome. So we got a Kikuchi rookie card. Joey Gallo. Ooh, that's a nice one. Shohei Otani, second year. And the Sandy Alcantara base. So we'll get that Otani sleeved up. I've heard some teams have also inquired about trading for Otani. Could you imagine if Otani went to another team? That would be pretty wild um, as the Angels continue to plummet further and further away from a playoff spot, unfortunately. So here we go, guys. Last pack, Magic. Pink Refractor Pack. We got a Chris Sale. Josh Rogers, that's not bad. Pete Alonzo, pink refractor rookie card. Let's get cooking, baby. Bang. There we go. We got one, boys. We got the Polar Bear, Pistol Pete Maravich Alonzo. Beautiful hit there. So saved by the chrome. Pete Alonzo, pink refractor rookie card. There we go, guys. Like I said, it ain't over till it's over. And how about that, ladies and gentlemen? The Pete Pink Refractor Rookie Card.
Come on, baby. That is huge. Alrighty. Let's see if we got anything in our last card. Looks like it's going to be a Lucas Giolito. So, overall, thought we did pretty well. Let's do a little recap. Some of the better hits and cards that we got. Got the Josh Rogers pink rookie. Noah Trader guard. We got the Tommy Medica gold. Ryan Howard red. Jordano Ventura rookie card. We got the gold Brian Anderson rookie from Arkansas. We got the Bowman silver to four ninety nine. My Soroka. We got the prospect of Valentine. We got the Walker Bueller. And then the three big hits of the break. We got the Shohei Otani 84 design chrome second year card. Andrew Benintendi variation rookie card. And the Pete Alonzo big meat Pete pink refractor rookie card. I'd say that was a success. So really appreciate you watching. If you enjoyed this, hook me up with a like. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And if you're new here, definitely subscribe. We're going to be doing a lot of new exciting openings once Tops begins to roll out the big releases in August. So that's going to do it, guys. I will catch you all on the next one. Peds Card Collection out. Take care.